Hey everybody, it's Mr. C. Welcome to another Fun Friday Science. Today we are making some film canister rockets. Let's wait for our materials to slide on over. And if you want to build our Alka-Seltzer rockets, first thing you're going to need is some Alka-Seltzer, water, a film canister, and tape. If you're going to build the baking soda rockets, baking soda, vinegar, a film canister, and don't forget, safety goggles for every time. Let's head on over outside to our build. All right, hey, welcome everybody. And we are on location in my front yard. Um, so it's not really that big of a location. Uh, but as you can see, we're outside because we are going to be shooting things off today. Because what day is today? Friday! And what do we do on Fridays? Fun, fun Friday! Fun Friday. Even at home, we do Fun Friday. So, as you can see, we've got all our materials here. If you're not sure the materials, we'll do a quick run through. Remember, I listed them all out before. But, first thing you're going to need, you're going to need a film canister. Um, now, if you get a film canister, you're going to need the one with the little clear plastic top right it's got a nice seal to it if you get that gray top it doesn't seal as well and then you get like a it doesn't do anything okay so you need a good film canister uh, we're gonna make two kinds of rockets we're gonna make Alka-Seltzer rockets or actually these are uh, Equate effervescent tablets for cold relief Walmart brand you're gonna need some water and then for the second rocket baking soda and our old friend vinegar now you've probably seen this before but i like to step it up a little bit and make it a little safer i have duct tape here we're going to use the duct tape to tape the tablet and we're going to make little packets of baking soda that way you don't have to hurry put it on and then try not to blow it up in your face okay uh safety if you anytime you do this wear goggles okay you gotta wear goggles right but it's only water and vinegar. Yeah. When this pops up and hits you in the face, you're going to be happy that you're wearing goggles. Okay? Let me introduce my special guest today. To my right, in the red shirt, we have Mr. Ken. Ken, outstanding. Thanks for joining us again on Fun Friday. And to my right, I have the one, the only, Mr. Plants. <laughs> That's yeah. that's his name. Hi, Mr. Plants. Hello, my that's, name is Plant. My you you want to get your rocket that you're, you know, yeah. yeah. My parents are crazy. They just named me Plant. Yeah, they something saw like it that. Outside of the okay. hospital. Okay. Me. Yeah. Hey. Okay. Hey. Good story. Okay. Yeah. So first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna open up our Alka-Seltzer tablets, and you only need about half. Okay. So I'm gonna break half. There's half for Ken, half for Plant, and then I've got half. For me okay now your next step what you're going to do is you're gonna cut off a little piece of duct tape okay and then just make a little loop a little loop of duct tape just like this and you're gonna tape go ahead and push it on the inside of your cap I'm gonna show our viewers at home what that looks like so you should have something that looks like this okay it should be nice and that's where we're going to put our Alka-Seltzer tablets. Okay. So I'm going to do that. I've got mine done. I'm going to go ahead and take care of Ken's here. And there you go, Ken. Go ahead and push that on there. Now you want to make sure that the tape doesn't interfere with the seal of the, uh, of the film canister. Otherwise, it's not going to get a good seal. There you go, sir. Um, it's not going to really work as well. Now I recommend, once you get your half, go ahead and break it again. So now you have quarters. And you're gonna put, put it in there as best you can, right? It may not fit perfectly, uh, but as long, and you wanna test it out, push it down, and then see if you turn it over, and, it, and see that wouldn't be good. I don't really wanna do that, because that doesn't give me a lot of time to react. Okay, so I'm gonna do another tape. And even if it does, right, this isn't that dangerous. No. Okay. And we'll pick up your Alka-Seltzer, dude. All right, so even if it doesn't work great, as long as it's a little sticky, 
you have a little bit of time, right? You, that's what you need is time. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and fill up their water. You only want to fill this up about halfway. You could even probably do a little less. Hey, Mr. Carey. Yep. Can I have another piece of duct tape? I think mine is just yep. not wet. So if you add a ton of water in there, let me see your cup. Okay. If you add a lot of water, uh, you may think, well, the more water I have, the better a reaction. Yes, but that's also less room for the gas to expand in there. So that's what we're doing, right? These work on pressure. The water reacts with the Alka-Seltzer. Thank you. Yep. And then it creates the gases, and then that builds up pressure, and that's what... Okay, so I'm going to fill mine up here. All right, and I've got... I'll show the viewers at home. You really only want about this much water. Right, that's about enough water. All right, so we're going to start off with Mr. Plant first. Okay, go ahead, carefully put it on there. Uh, you have it upside down there. Wow. Wow. Uh, he, so he... <laughs> I'll, I'll do it. Wow, that needs to go in like the outtakes or something. I'll do it. Uh, yeah, let's let's have Ken, who was paying attention. <laughs> I'm sorry. Mr. Wow, he put it on the top. Yeah, why don't you just? Um, hey, can all right, I have and go ahead and push it down. Okay, turn it over, shake it up. All right, here we go. Step back. Now, what's going to happen is that's going to build up pressure. Let's go ahead and move this so you can see it. You can see it foaming a little bit. It's going to explode. And it will eventually, I can see it. Oh yeah, there it goes. Wow. Hi. Okay, that was probably our best one. Yeah. All right, let's try it again. Oh my gosh, it's dry. Yeah, that's really cool. All right, uh, it's also helpful to have a towel here uh, so you can uh, wipe up little messes like that. Oh my gosh. That was good, that was good. Okay, you need some tape? Yes. And then we're gonna do one in slow motion. We'll do mine in slow motion, you can see how cool this actually looks. Oh man, that was amazing. All right, so we're gonna tape up Mr. Plants here. <laughs> Not a Why are you laughing? Yeah, it's, yeah, I don't know. I'm I, offended. I just work here, so. Not offended. All right. Wow. That was, that was, that was a good one. That was and really good. And it's dry. Oh my goodness, it's um, dry. Okay, and. I think it's crumbling a It's all right, go ahead. Good, seal it. All right, there you go. And you can even give it a little shake. Oh. You got a few seconds, right? I mean, again, that's why you put a lot of, leave a lot of space for air. Uh, that's one of the reasons why you do it. So now I can way. see it. Oh, yes! That's Boom! One. All right, let's see one in slow motion. Let's take a look at it. All right, All right we're back, and we're going to do a little slow-mo video here. And I'm gonna go ahead, so I've got mine already prepped, about half of water, about a eh, third. Got my Alka-Seltzer tabs in there. And test them out, they look pretty stable. So let's go ahead and, oh, that's. And here we go. Let's take a look. If I can follow this. There it goes over there. Well, right, hey, that uh, was pretty cool, right? Oh, Alka-Seltzer yeah. in water works really well. So now, let's go on to the second rocket. Our old friends, baking soda and vinegar. Well, they aren't really friends. Well, they're not really friends. Can I have the towels over there, please? Baking All right. Soda. Yeah, they're not really, I mean, our friends. They're not friends with each other. Yeah, they don't like each other. No. So the key here, and I've seen this done um, on YouTube. And a lot of people do this as like a race against time. Like it's, hurry, put it in there, and then it like goes up in their hands. Now, if you're lucky, nothing's gonna happen to you. Uh, it just may pop your hand a little bit. If you're unlucky, it's gonna go right in your face. So I've got a patented method. Well, it's not patented, it's patent pending, of how you can give yourself an extra time and actually make it look really cool. So I like to use tea bags. Okay, I cut, op I cut open a tea bag, and I use like herbal tea that I never drink. 
So you have a little packet right here. I'll show my viewers, or our viewers. So you got a little tea bag right here, okay? And that's where we're gonna put the baking soda. And I have a teaspoon. You only need about a teaspoon. Again, you don't need a ton of this stuff. Okay, a little teaspoon. About that. I go ahead and shovel it in. You know, and that's actually gonna be plenty, right? And I'll show the viewers at home what that looks like. That's about that much baking soda, okay? You don't need a whole lot. And then what I do is I like to fold the top and that seals it, and then I just kind of roll it in on itself. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna make sure that uh, make sure our caps are completely dry. Go and take your caps, make sure they're completely dry because we want the tape to stick on them. Because we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna put a little loop of tape and we're gonna do a little loop of tape Oh, question. Oh, uh, when yours went off, it hit a bug and now it's dead. Oh, wow. It's not dead, it's still... Oh. Yeah, you should... Lost a wing, but... It's... Ah! Okay, so, <laughs> I've got my loop of tape here, and so I'm going to put it in... Mr. Ken's, and you just want to make sure it's completely dry in there. Okay, the driest you can get it, the better. That, that's going to keep your tape sticking. Okay? Tape goes in. And then, the top that you folded down, you're actually going to put that, and I need to make sure I know where that is, you're actually going to put that upside down, okay? Just like this. And that way, oh, look at that. No baking sodas coming out. Look at that. That is beautiful. Woo! Let's show our viewers. So this, basically, it's like a little timer, okay? And then once you turn it over, the vinegar reacts with the baking soda, but only when I turn it over, not before. Okay, let's go ahead and prep that again. So we're gonna put that here. Let's go ahead and take, uh, where's your cap? Your cap, the cap, uh, the cap, the cap. Oh my goodness, there it is. <laughs> vinegar. All right, let me go ahead and fill up with vinegar. And again, you don't need to fill it up. You only need about half. That's good. About half, anything more than that, you're, it's just gonna, you're not going to get as an impressive of a launch. Now, it'll still go, but it's going to be kind of a... Like right. this. So I'm going to go ahead and take Ready? some more... Nope, not yet. Let's get let's get a... Uh, who's loaded up here? My name is Plant, sir. Mm -hmm. Is it? Yeah. Okay. So there's your... Where's your cap? My cap? I just gave it oh, to you. Oh, you just gave it to me. <laughs> Whoops! That was my bad. I'll take the hit on that one. Oh, that, was, that was my bad. That was my bad. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so, oh, same thing. Am I putting Alka Seltzer in there? And no <laughs> one's gonna stop me. Like, yeah. Oh, he's putting Alka Seltzer. Sorry. In there. Yeah, that's all right. I'm sorry. So again, I take my teaspoon of baking soda. And I just kind of put it in oh. my open tea bag. Okay. Now you don't have to use this. You can take your chances and just put it in. But I like this because I think it's a safer option. Um. You know, and again, it's all fun and games. Until someone gets hurt. Until someone gets hurt or someone loses an eye, right? <laughs> oh my goodness. Especially with this. So there you go. That looks good. So I'm going to give that to him over here. Ready? My name's Plant. Plant. I, it's, it's so hard for me to say that <laughs> name. It's yeah. like it really is. Well, it, yeah. Kind of makes me feel yeah, when down. You, but what happens when you let your kids name themselves? You know? Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. That's right. Hey, fun fact. Uh, you can even ask my mom about this. Um, when I was, I think about four or five, apparently there was a show I used to watch. I don't know what it was. And my nickname was called Firefly. Firefly? And I insisted that my mom, whenever we went to the store, I would not respond to my name, Paul. I would make her call me Firefly. <laughs> so, yeah, that's... Uh, Teabag on the loose. Teabag's on the loose. That's all right. We'll get it. All right, so I'm going to load mine up here. And you have vinegar. All right, let's go ahead and have... Plant, you, since you did yours right this time, <laughs> let's go ahead and, uh, thank goodness. Okay, Mr. Plant's going to go ahead. Hallelujah. And carefully snap it down, turn it over, and go. Here we go. Now, this should react pretty quickly. If it leaks a little bit, that's okay. Let's take a look. Just like that. I can put my face on. 
any minute now. Please go. Good. <laughs> and that landed right there. Yo! That was pretty good. So it takes a little bit longer, but I think the tea bag uh, keeps it. It just slows the reaction down a little bit, allows it to build up gases. I don't really know. That's what I think is happening. Is it my turn? Uh, hey, comment below if you think you know the reason why. I'd love to hear it. Uh, but that is my observation, is the tea bag, it actually slows down the vinegar getting in there. It builds up, has more time to build up pressure, which then... Ken's going to give it a go. Also, comment below if you think my name is weird. Comment below if you know his name is weird. Don't blame me. Blame my parents. Okay. Turn it over. You don't need to look at it. He's like uh, looking at it like in his face. Uh, like what? All right, let's take a look. I, I don't think I'm going to be able to follow this. I shook it up real good. I shook it up. Oh! Well done. Where is it? All right, folks, we're back. And hey, you can see... We have a finale for you. We've got a little rainbow launch. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue. Don't forget. There's purple too. Rainbow colors Are for me and you. you. Oh, oh, boy. Yeah, it's Mickey Mouse. Okay, so we are going to do this very quickly and I've got it on slow-mo. So let's go ahead and move our caps closer. And I'm gonna start off. Need you guys to be ready. So I'll do, I'll do red and orange. I'll do yellow and green. Oh, see, that's already not I'll gonna do, work. Wait, how about you do yellow and blue, and I'll do purple and green. Okay, we're gonna go ahead. Get a reset here. All right, so, so Ken does yellow and green. Mr. Plant does blue and purple. All right, so key here obviously is not pushed down too hard. Yep. Okay, ready? Get get them ready. That won't work. That's fine. You got, you got it right there. And here we go. Okay, put it on. Go. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> You see? <laughs> All right, hey, if you liked that video, <laughs> don't forget to subscribe yeah! down here. And if you didn't see last Fun Friday, click down here. This is all saying for now, Mr. Plants. Yeah! Thank you so much, yeah! Mr. Ken. Whoa! Always a pleasure. What the, what I'll see you guys. Say?